Hey everyone, Servo here, and welcome back to Dragon Age 2. Now, actually what I did was cheat. And because it took me so long to find that stupid pub, and I could have gone, like, immediately. I could have gone basically as soon as I met Varric, but I'm stupid and uh, bad at the map and like couldn't figure out how to do it. And you can't get Fenris until you talk to Varric at that pub, because I looked this up because I was just like, why couldn't I get to that pub? This seems ridiculous. And you could, because I'm dumb. So I actually went way back to an earlier save and picked up Fenris much earlier and took him on some quests with me that made them easier. He was really helpful with, like, the Fenrir well, quest. Look here, boys. Volunteers. Clap him in irons and let's see what the Tevinters will pay for him. Make him talk. I can do that. Andraste's great flaming ass. How did you do that? Never mind, I, I've stashed the boy in a cave, a smuggler hideout on the wounded coast. Tevinters will be by to finish the deal today. Now, c c can I go? Sure. Oh, wait. I meant no. And also, really, with the Kunari... He made that a lot easier. Ah, my right hand arrives. Summon your era, Shock. The bargain is done. About time you showed. I've been here for hours. Shokost, Maras Shokra, Anan Isamkun. Look hewn from an elf. The madness of this place. Friend of yours? Friend of no one. Yes, well, that said, I'm here to report that your hated Talbashoth were felled, one and all, right? Yes, they were. So, I'm ready to open negotiations for the explosive powder. As we agreed. No. He's not getting it. Make your chatty elf say something. Any insight that would help? Kunari, do not abandon a debt. I humbly request clarification from the Arishok. I have a growing lack of disgust for you. The dwarf imagined the deal for the Gatlock. He invented a task to prove his worth when he has none. Then we have wrongly inserted ourselves in your affairs. Would you have us kill this dwarf? Wait, what now? If you face Talvashoth, he is not worthy of dying to you, as he was not worthy of dying to them. But you, you keep good company. Let him live, and leave. He had big plans for your recipe. I was supposed to get a piece of that. Dwarf, did your imaginary bargain make promises on my behalf? I uh, expected your wisdom to be more profitable. Then you will pay on my behalf. It's not at all. Take your coin, take whatever. Hornhead Oxman and Mongrel. Dog lords, suck your own powder and blow your head off, sod it. You will leave as well, human. There's no more coin for you here. So now I'm, like, super friends with him. Um, I still don't like you, Anders, you and your Dorito face. Um, but yeah, so that's what's happened. I, I've done all the same quests again. I just didn't record it again because some of it I've already, like, put up as episodes. Um, so, so yeah, things have happened differently a little bit, so it may change the outcome of the future of the game, I don't know. But, um, so yeah, I'm, I'm back here with 
I've just talked to Anders, who's... I don't like you. You're a little bit intense. Um, yeah. So now what do, I, what do I have to do? Oh, I have to go rescue his friend Carl the Mage. Yeah. Yeah. I should probably not bring Fenris. Probably. It took a lot of party switching. I did a lot of party switching so that I wouldn't anger either Meryl or Fenris. Because I want to be friends with both of them. And they're like polar opposites. So... Let's not bring you. Let's bring Aveline, I guess? Yeah, that'll work. Okay, so we want to go to High Town at night. Down here nope, 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 nope. Oh, okay. I can leave this way. Good, 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 good. Yes. And I tried to give everybody the same abilities when I when I leveled them up. Um, but I. Why is that glowing? I thought I had to go to High Town. At night. Okay, anyway. Um, yeah, I tried to give everybody the same abilities. I don't remember if I did or not. Um, so I basically had to play a couple hours of the game over again. Um, that was fine. Especially because Fenris made things easier. <laughs> um, how do I... Nope. Uh, and I like Fenris. I know people are like, Ooh, is emo and broody. I don't know. I think he's kind of funny. He has dry sense of humor. Hi, Anders. I saw Carl go inside a few minutes ago. Carl. No Templars so far. Are you ready? What if I just said not yet? <laughs> I didn't see anyone suspicious out here. Let's do this fast. All right. I'll handle the talking. You watch for Templars. Mm -hmm. oh, maybe I shouldn't have brought Aveline. Shoot. She likes Templars. Oh well. You know what? Aveline is never going to be my friend. When we find Carl, just let me talk to him. Okay. Somebody likes candles. Okay. Um. We're going to get attacked all over the place, aren't we? <laughs> is there any. Oh god. Music. Hi. Is there anything cool around here? What's that? Oh, wait, wait. That is, is a thing. Oh. It's a long ass poem. Okay, well. Whatever. Oh, but it updated my codex. Okay. Varric, what in the world are you doing to me? That's rude, sir. Please. Please desist. Music, stop. Music, calm down. Anything over here for... Oop. Oh! Carl's right there. Well, hold on. I'm gonna check the rest of this place first. <laughs> this seems very suspicious. <laughs> Ooh, a shiny. Yeah? No? I... I can't pick that up? Well, fine. I don't like you either. He's just standing there, looking weird. I don't like it. Ooh, I can go in there. Sure. Get. 
Okay, let's go talk to Creepy Carl over here. Anders, I know you too well. I knew you would never give up. He's looks What's like wrong? Joel. Why are you talking like I was too rebellious, like you. The Templars knew I Oh, did they make I you tranquil? Be... Made an this example quest of. is called Tranquility. You're... How else will mages ever master themselves? You'll understand, Anders. As soon as the Templars oh. teach you to control yourself. Ah, shit. Oh, no. This is the apostate. Oh, no. Whoa. Yeah, what the hell is up with this, Anders? What? Wow. never take another mage as you took him. What the f Fuck. Okay, 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 dog. Hey, 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 you get, you leave from my, yeah. Ah. Oh god, 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 oh god. Okay, yeah, 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 Varric, I'm joining you, I'm joining you. Ah, I can't with the map and the... Okay, you know what, I'm trying to get over to you and shoot you. Eh, 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 eh. Okay, you know what, ah, pause it, pause it, pause it for a sec, pause it for a sec, okay. Aveline needs a stamina thing, and you need a magic thing. I guess Farrah can have a stamina thing too. God, the music. Okay. I want to be me. Oh god, there's guys over here. Ah! Oh god, they're everywhere! Oh, I didn't. Ah! Shoot! Ugh! Ow, 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 get away, get away, get away, get away, get away, get away. Ugh. Oh, Dad, I don't mean to keep looting these guys in the middle of the battle. I get away from me, get away from me. Oh, I just died. Ah, that's the first time I've died. I... Anders, what did you do? It's like... You brought a piece of the Fade into this yeah, world. Yeah, what did you do? I had already forgotten what that feels like. Um... <laughs> what did you do? Not the Fade, yeah, yeah, yeah. the angry glow. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like a gateway to the Fade inside you, glowing like a beacon. I have some unique circumstances, yes. Oh, God. But, Carl, what happened? How did they get you? The Templars here are far more vigilant than in Ferelden. They found a letter I was writing you. You cannot imagine it, Anders. All the color, all the music in the world, gone. I would gladly give up my magic. But this, I'll never be whole again. This is what Mother was protecting me from. Please, kill me before I forget again. Mo. I don't know how you brought it back, but it's fading. Carl, no. Oh, jeez. Maybe we can find a cure. No. Can you cure a beheading? The dreams of tranquil mages are severed. There is nothing left of them to fix. I would rather die a mage than live as a Templar puppet. Well, that's... Uh... That's what he wants. My sister calls being tranquil a fate worse than death. Give him peace. I got here too late. I'm sorry, Carl. I'm so sorry. Now, it's fading. Why do you look at me like that? Sucks to be Goodbye. you, Carl. <laughs> We should leave before more Templars come. Yeah, I want to know what your unique circumstances so, are, guess. Anders. This is the part Anders. where you tell me you're an abomination. 
You're wrong. But not far wrong. I... This is hard to explain. When I was in Amaranthine, I met a spirit of justice who was trapped outside the Fade. We became friends, and he recognized Wait, the injustice that mages in Thedas face every day. Isn't the spirit of justice who you meet in the mage origin story? And that's origins? different than a demon. Just as demons prey on the deadly sins of mankind, there are good spirits who embody our virtues. Spirits of compassion, fortitude, justice. They are the Maker's first children, and they have all but given up on us. I don't know what you're saying. What does this have to do with your eyes glowing? Yeah. To live outside the Fade, he needed a oh, host. Oh, good. I offered to help him. We were going to work together, bring justice to every child ever ripped away from his mother to be sent to the circle. Good. But I guess I had too much anger. Once he was inside me, he changed. Oh, good. So you have this spirit of justice living in your head? It's not like that. He's gone now. He's part of me. Mm. It's not like we can have a conversation. I feel his thoughts as my own. That's weird, not Anders. Even the greatest scholar could tell you where I end and he begins. That's weird, Anders. That really didn't look like a happy, benevolent spirit from where I was standing. Since when is justice happy? Justice is righteous. Justice is hard. You tried to help a friend. Surely no harm can come of that. I wish I still had your innocence. There was too much hatred in me. Justice thought he would overcome that. But my anger, when I see Templars now, things that have always outraged me, but I could never do anything about. You and Aveline aren't going to get he along. Comes out. And he is no longer my friend, Justice. He is a force of vengeance, and he has no grasp of mercy. So you go berserker, basically. Oh, now I can. F I'm not going to flirt with you. I'm sorry. I don't like you. G select it, please. Can you bring him out at will? No. He comes only when I've lost all power over oh, myself. Oh, good. It's a madness. Oh, a frenzy. Yeah, you go berserker. I only find out after what I might have done. Oh, Jesus. Can justice ever be separated from you? Not. I don't think so. The only way a spirit has ever been separated from a living host is by its death. I don't like you so much. The curses of my own making. Uh -huh. All I can do now is hope to control it. Didn't I just ask if you could control it? Yeah. Wow. Your problems make mine seem small. <laughs> Here. These are all the documents I have for this area. I can understand if you would rather me not join you personally. Mm. I cannot control my need for vengeance. I would ask no one to take on the danger of traveling with me. I will be here in my clinic if you need me. Do I need you? Oh, God. So many party members. Oh, my God. Uh, I don't know. I, I, uh, damn it. <laughs> oh, you, well, I'm gonna put Fenris back in my party. Go, oh, Bethany! Yay! I'm hurt. Oh, that's because I died. Probably that's the first time I've died. Um, how do I? Uninjure myself. Ah, this gonna be like origins where I like double click it and it works. Yes, it is okay. 
I saw shiny things. Oh, it's just a fire. Lie to me. Wait, where am I? Oh, I'm... What the... Why are you standing there? Wait, talk to Varric. Oh, and these are random. I picked these up at my house during my um, second cheating playthrough thing. Um... That one, too. Oh, God. So many quests! Can I... You look like you're there to be talked to. Oh, I'm... Ve what the hell? I'm be Varric. What have you thought of the weather lately? <laughs> no one's gonna answer. Hi, Fenris. Get out of my way. Your weapons of Patakti, you. I've been neglecting oh. my patients lately. Okay. I should spend more time here. So you're you're not. I can't speak to you. Can I? No, nobody can level up. Um. Yeah, see, I'm pretty good friends friends with Fenris now. <laughs> Suppose the last time. Oh, look, I'm really close to leveling up. Well, I am at least. So is most people. Very why are you so far behind? Okay. Um. Oh God. Okay. So now there's quests to pick. So many quests. Let's go talk to Varric. Why not? How do I get out of here? Can I get out of here through here? I say the blight's done. So where's your beard, elf? Wait, are they talking? Elves don't grow beards. Huh. I thought maybe you shaved it off in a little broody peak. <laughs> so you're a funny dude. Yes, yes he is. I like it when Varric and Fenris talk. It's hilarious. Okay, um... Wait, shoot, where was I going? Oh, the pub. I guess I'm gonna go to the day... In the daytime? I should have marked that quest as... Ap 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 Let's just go here. I don't know if it'll matter. Oh, alright. You owe us, Isabella. Oh. Well, Lucky, I'll tell you what. Since the information you gave me was worth nothing, that's what I'll pay you. Oh, your costume Me and my boys will get our money's worth, bitch. That's rude. Oh, poor sweet thing. It looked like she smashed his head on her boobs, but... Totally gets Assassin's Creed music. Tell me, Lucky, is this worth dying for? I thought this was gonna be about the Deep Roads Expedition quest, but suddenly Isabella. <laughs> I didn't think so. God, her boobs are just. Are, are insane. Wait, I can talk to Varric and I can talk to Isabella? Um. Talk? My. And here I thought the only men in this place were besotted fools who couldn't hoist the mainsail. <laughs> When you talk about hoisting the mainsail, what do you Oh, really what do you mean? think she means? What else could it mean? It requires strength, 
knowledge of rigging <laughs> and a small measure of sobriety. Her, her, her. No, that's. I know my way around rigging just fine. Oh my god! I'm good with. I didn't mind. even pick a flirt option. Oh my! I'm Isabella, previously Captain Isabella. Sadly, without my ship, the title rings a bit hollow. You're Ferelden, aren't you? You have that look about you. I was in Denerim not too long ago. Mm -hmm. You know, you might be just what I'm looking for to solve a little problem I have. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Can't anyone fix their own lives around nope. here? Nope. It's all up to me. Must be something in the water. Someone from my past has been pestering me. I've arranged for a duel. If I win, he leaves me alone. But I don't trust him. Okay, to play I was gonna say I can't I fight your duel for back. you. <sighs> yeah, why me? What makes you think I'm right for this? You saw me talking to Lucky, didn't you? Those boys couldn't manage simple information gathering. I can't trust the riffraff in this place to do anything right. But you, you're different. You've known me for five minutes. Not even that long. Ah, uh, pick it, please. Why a duel? <laughs> I like jewels. It's what I do. And if I win, he'll be dead. Problem solved. Do I really want to... You wanted information from Lucky. What was it? I asked Lucky and his boys to track down something I lost. They failed to do it. It's nothing to worry about, and this is much more important. Uh... Who's this person you've arranged like to meet? It's like glowing in the background there. His name there. is Hader. We worked together back in Antiva. He's never liked me. He's been asking about me all around Kirkwall. Thought I'd get it over with and meet him face to face. Oh, whatever, I guess. I think I could manage watching your back. <laughs> I'll bet. Oh my god, stop. You stop. I arranged to meet Hader in Hightown after dark. I'll meet you there. I'm only flirting with Meryl and Fenris right now. Okay, but I can still talk to, to Varric here? Oh, boobs, lady. God. So, I've been dying to know. What was going through your head when you fought that ogre? Um, yep. For the first few seconds, what do they feed those things? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know anyone else that's even seen one. You're lucky just to be standing here. Somehow, Hawk, I imagine things won't be dull with you around. Have they been dull? Not that I expect the deep roads to be boring, mind you. Constant threat of doom does tend to keep you awake. Boop. Anything in particular I should know about your brother? To understand Bartrand, you've got to understand the Dwarven Merchants Guild. These are dwarves who would sell their mothers if they thought it'd get them a better share of the Lyrium market. <laughs> Anyone who deals with them has to sleep with a knife under their pillow. In my family, that's Bartrand. Oh, good. Good to know. What are your plans for this trip into the Deep Roads? Bartrand's running the show. On Draste's ass, he'd probably do that even if we weren't paying for everything. The tide we're looking for is supposed to be a week's travel from the surface. Tig. So I hope you aren't scared of the dark. We've got supplies, muscle, excavators. The plan is to carry out everything that's not nailed down. Um, okay. If we'll be working together, I should find out well, more about you. He's been hanging out with me for true enough. a long damn time. I suppose you ought to know my credentials. My family came from Orzammar. Noble House Tethrus, until my father got caught fixing provings. He and our whole house got exiled. No huge loss. I was born up here. Sunshine suits me just fine. And why don't you have a beard? Are you a merchant? A mercenary? I'm a younger son. It's a difficult and dangerous profession. A lot of us die of boredom. <laughs> Fortunately, being Bartrand's younger brother keeps me on my toes. Maker knows he lacks subtlety. I'm the one who pulls strings to keep the coterie out of our hair. Keep us just a whisker ahead of the other families. 
I think that's all I can ask him. Why is that aggressive? Boop. A lot of things can keep you awake, you know. I wouldn't reach for the doom first. Sure, I could have a cup of tea in the morning, but I hear it's bad for hey, you. I like tea. I've spent my whole life in Kirkwall. Dangerous enough most days, but it doesn't compare to the deep roads. So, this will be, let's just call it an adventure. Sure. I guess. Great. Now we're adventurers. Why not? Hey, I got some friendship points with Varric. Cool, because I wasn't very high with him. Oh, that's better. Look at my friends. Still better friends with Fenris and Varric, though. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. So what have I, what have I, what have I, what have I? Oh, God. Um... That was something I picked up at my house. Oh god, what's this? Oh, that's Isabella's thing. Oh god, okay, there's so much stuff to do. Well, I met Isabella, so maybe I'll go do Isabella's quest? I guess... Aww. There's also a thing where I'm supposed to meet a Thenril. Yeah. Okay, well let's do her 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 quest questy thing. Let's Did I mark it? Yeah, I marked it. And then I didn't even pay attention to where I'm supposed to go. Shoot! Why do I just do that? High Town After Dark. Oh, wait, this other one's... Oh, no, those are both in the day. Okay, well, let's go... Let's go do Isabella's quest. Let's not go do Isabella, because she seems really eager to do... Do Hawk, apparently. Um... Doo -doo -doo. How do I get out? Oh god, that's not getting out of here. You know, you cannot wish the Templars away. I can try. Is the circle here truly so terrible an option? Do you really have to ask that? You would be kept safe from others as well as from yourself. And they would be kept safe from you. I didn't ask for this. Nobody asks for their fate. It's funny because when I replayed um, the birthright quest, I said different things just just for fun, and she actually said she wouldn't mind going to the circle. I think it was kind of a joke, but basically she said if she had a place of her own, she wouldn't mind it. Yeah, what is this exc exclamation point, by the way? It's probably another quest, huh? Is that right here? Should we pick up another quest? On the way to a quest? Sure! Did I just get that quest? Or... Eh. I did! Okay. Well, let's go do Isabella. Do Isabella's quest! <laughs> <laughs> Nobody's doing Isabella. All right. Boop, 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 boop. Who's fighting? Who's fighting? I'm in fight mode. There's like one red dot way over here. Are you kidding me? Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, 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 okay. You can't fucking see a thing. Oh, 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 excuse me. Excuse me. 
Excuse me, please. Excuse me, please. Excuse me, please. Excuse me, please. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. Who just made that shrieky, girly shriek? Oh. Oh, 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 oh. God, 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 God. Health potion on myself. And she needs some help. Are we good? Are we good? Okay, I kind of wasted those potions, but whatever, whatever. At least we're not dying. I should be able to level up. Give me things. That was a lot of freaking people. They looked like one dot on the map. That was a lie. Big dirty lie. Okay, where is Isabella? There she is. There you are. Well, I've been I here for tried hours. to get to you. Hasn't shown up. No one has. You're not even like wearing this. pants. I don't like this. <laughs> That's right up there with what could possibly go wrong. Isabella, what's wrong with your That's clothes? That's the witch we're looking for. Got her. Oh God, are we in a new fight? Oh God. Excuse me, bye. 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 Oh, stop running. Ugh, I hate when I he just sent them. Search the bodies. Okay. I need to find out where he <laughs> I already am ahead of ya. Hiding in the chantry and sending thugs to finish me off. Coward. He'll not get away with this. Come on. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, they're shinies. I have to get them. Moonshine. Wait, am I literally fall? Jesus, come back! I didn't know I was, like, actually running after you. Hoi! No, no, no! Isabella, I don't like your quest! It's not fun, it's not fun, it's not fun. Nobody sees me, nobody sees me, nobody sees me, nobody sees me, nobody sees me. Why can I never use that pinning shot? It doesn't work. Someone's shooting at me from another direction. Oh, no you don't. Ah, stop running, I thought that. I hate that. Okay, I think you guys are on top of it. You know what? What? Ooh, hey, hey. Yeah. Look at me leveling up. Sure. That's it. That's everybody who can level up. Oh, you guys are both so close. Oh, God, Isabella. Okay, okay. Hold on, I have to loot everyone. You're a pirate, you should understand. Oh my god, come back. Um, really? Isabella, should have known you'd find me here. Tell your men to burn the letters next time. Castillon was heartbroken when he heard about the shipwreck. You should have let him know you survived. It must have slipped my mind. <laughs> Where's the relic? I lost it. Castillon's just going to have to do without. Lost it? Just like you lost a ship full of valuable cargo? They weren't cargo, Hader. They were people. Those slaves were worth a hundred sovereigns a head. And you let them scurry off into the wilds. And now the relic's gone too. Oh, she freed some slaves. Castillo won't be happy to hear that. I promise you. Why don't 
Select it. Will someone explain what's going on? Isabella's been a very bad girl. Ruined a perfect business deal and then ran away. She didn't tell you? I told him enough. I said I arranged for a duel, which I did. I also said you wouldn't play fair, which you didn't. We can talk later if you want. Right now we have other problems. Uh, boop. Castillon isn't a very happy person, is he? Maybe he needs a new hobby. <laughs> There's only one way to settle this. Are we gonna fight you? Ah! Oh, why, why her? Oh, Jesus Christ, Isabella. Oh, my God. Okay, I got this new thing here. behind me. Oh, no, you don't. Excuse me, please. How rude of you. I'll deal with this. Uh, boop. Oh, no, 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 no. Spawning behind me like a cheater. It's very uncool of you. out. I don't like this. I don't like it at all. Okay, oh my god, pause for a sec. Jesus Christ. Alright, give me some health. You can have some magic and some health. I don't think I can help you, Fenris. I'm sorry. You got knocked out. Oh, okay. Jesus. Uh, first, ask questions later. Ugh. Trust me. It's better this Got way. All the blood. Castillon won't hear about me from Hader, but he'll find me eventually. I just have to get him the relic. Simple as that. Mm-hmm. Oh, Jesus, there's so much. What's this about you freeing slaves? Well, it's a good thing. I was asked to escort Castillon's cargo ship. I got a bad feeling about the job partway through. Boarded the ship to find slaves. Nearly 200. Elves, humans, children even. It was sickening. They paid Castillon to take them away from the Blight. He took their money and sold them into slavery. Even I can see that's wrong. Well then, he's an asshole. Oh god, so many questions. What's so interesting about the relic? I don't really know what it is, except that it's ancient and worth my weight in gold. Castion has me chasing it down as payback for freeing his slaves. <sighs> to be honest, I think he just wants me dead. But that would be letting me off easy. You hired Lucky to track down information on the relic. That's right. He insisted he knew everything that was going on in Kirkwall. He lied. <laughs> I bet he doesn't even know everything going on in his pants. Okay, Miss Innuendo. Did you end up in Kirkwall because your ship was destroyed? There was a storm. The ship ran aground on the reefs near the city. I managed to make it to shore. Most of my men weren't as lucky. Poor sods. I knew some of those men almost ten years. Ah, oh, balls. Balls? I guess I'll help you. If getting the relic gets Castillon off your back, then I'll help you retrieve it. I guess. I still don't know where it is, but you'll be the first to know if I hear anything. Anyway, thanks for helping me out with Hayden. Yeah, no problem. I think I'll tag along for a while. There might be something I could do for you. You better. I just killed about and 40 I have a guys. And I'm man if you're looking for you? company later. No. D -d 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 Holy shit, look at all these people. I, there are too many people. Fenris, why are you just covered in blood? You're the only one. What's wrong with you? Oh my god. I have no idea what to do next. Like, none. 
Um, I haven't... Okay, I'm gonna take Bethany out of my party, put Meryl in there. Um, God, there's so many people. I don't even know how to handle this many people. I really don't. Oh, look, they can level up. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, what are my quests? Oh. I guess I could just keep talking to Isabella. Okay. So we're going to talk to Isabella. Is there anything here to loot? Ah, there is. Well, there was. Uh, oop, sparkle guy in the corner. The bodice ripper. Really? <laughs> okay. We're leaving. Okay, so we need to get to... Oop. Oh, I didn't really say if it was day or night. Probably doesn't matter. Didn't matter last time. Where are you, Isabella? There you are. Eh, what if I could just click on you from a distance? Nope. Nope, I can't. The heavy necklace you got on. Mika. I think he's ignoring me now. Fenris just glows. Hey, is my coin not good enough for you? Oh, Hawk. Thanks for helping me with that little problem I had. You going to buy me a drink to celebrate our victory? No. You drink buy me the one. Here. It's an acquired taste. Oh, before I forget, are you still looking for work? Because I, I have a I friend who needs some help. Sure, why not? A friend not? of yours is a friend of mine. What can I do? He didn't say, and I didn't ask, but I'm sure you're up to it. His name's Martin. He has a room right here in the Hanged Man. Tell him I sent you. Now, you going to leave me to my drinking or what? Oh, Fenris, you're injured. I'm sorry. Let me help you. Uh, Here we go. I'm sorry, buddy. Well, actually, you know what? I've almost done an hour of recording, so... Um, Yay, Isabella, I guess. Um, um, what if I click on you? You know that guy Marlow at the bar downstairs? Don't make no. eye contact, whatever you do. Ferris, what are you doing? Sour ale, vomit, the smell of desperation. And that's just on the good menu. And you keep a room here? <laughs> Not all of us can squat in the lap of luxury. Not without tipping, anyway. Hey, he used to be a slave. Leave him alone. It's awfully noisy in here. Really? I just hear some, like... Light music. Okay, anyway, so that's uh, that's going to be it for this episode of Dragon Age 2. Fenris, what are you doing down there, anyway? Uh, <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I actually still don't really know what I'm doing or what the plot of this is or, or what order quests to do any of this crap in. And I don't know why I have so many companions. Like, how am I supposed to take all of these people around with me? Anyway, so that was it, and I hope you guys will come back for more Dragon Age 2. Bye.